have a mission for you. Oh, this, this is fucking cruel tangents. Tangents, yeah. Hey, she was in Buffy! If you enjoyed this video and you want to see more, make sure to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. We post new episodes every week, and we'd hate for you to miss one. Dumb face. They sure uh, are lucky that they had those Dora cells on hand, or they'd be fucking dead. <laughs> what the fuck is? Oh, cheesecake bites. Right, yeah. Oh, that's hot. That's hot. Jesus. I like how she yeah, just took one bite, sexual. then it's put the rest on the maybe. box, and was like, "Nah, fuck this." Man, uh, whenever this is, women eat this is fucking hot too. It always has to be like the sexiest way. It's just like. I like that they yeah. followed the <laughs> like they followed the sexy cheesecake bite commercial with, with the sexy with, hemorrhoid commercial. Yeah, with <laughs> fucking hemorrhoid cream. And now who's Whoa. this? Sexy hairdo. Across the country and in Massachusetts, we've seen an upsweep of violence in our schools. I'm Congressman Marty Meehan. Today, parents and the school went boom. <laughs> Arm the teachers. Stewart! Stewart! Stewart? Wait, that's the kid from Jerry Maguire, isn't it? It is. Yeah, you don't remember? No. And that's the guy from Bird... Actually, I didn't either. On video and DVD. You know that, uh, that old girl from, uh, from, uh, Cutthroat and Beetlejuice. That's Gina Davis. You Cutthroat got Island. Hugh Laurie as, as the pop. Uh, then you got Michael J. Fox as Stuart Little, am I right? As the little stew. And then Nathan Lane as the cat? Mm hmm Yeah. Star-studded, my friend. It's funny, the little kid is probably like the least biggest star of all those people named. The least biggest, even. But he's the main actor. Is he? No, he's not! It's Stuart Little is the main! I he's the main? He's the main, It's called man. Stuart Little! Yeah, but you don't see his face. You see the kid's face. What? <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about?! If... Okay, here's my theory. Is Stuart Little's face? No, he's not a live action is he like, thing, though. Is he like in fucking Plan 9 where he walks around like this <laughs> for the whole second act? Eddie. Because <laughs> he fucking died halfway through production. <laughs> no, no, no. And now he's a foot taller. Um, no, it's if you got a cartoon character, he's not the main character. What are you talking Why? Why? What is this logic? He's not the main star. What? St Stuart Little isn't a star. Michael it's, J. Fox is definitely a star. But you don't see and Michael he's J. Fox's Stuart face. Stuart Little, the titular character. I would say live action face actors supersede a voice actor. Oh. I'm so role. sorry, all voice actors out there. If it's in a role, yeah. Even though you know so many names of voice actors and shit and like fucking hold them dear. Not many. You say this. Not that many. You say this. I hold them dear, but I don't know them by name. And neither of you have seen the movie, right? That little kid is a piece of shit. He's barely in the movie. Hugh Laurie is the second best. I didn't say second best. No, no, no. Second best is. I'm sure like, he is. He's like the mo. He's the second most like fucking. Seen? Yeah. Oh. What cat? But apparently, voice actors don't matter. <laughs> what is this creepy ass? There. I don't know. I what's thought they happening. were pimps. This what am just, I looking it at? It just came in like this. They might still be. They came uh, in like a wreck. <laughs> timely. Yeah, knocking over that china plate. It doesn't. See, here's a question, right? Who's the main star, Elliot or the guy who did all the ET's voices and noises? I'd say it's the character designer and the special effects team. Yeah, I agree. I'm down with that. He might. Who won all the awards? Steven actually, Spielberg. Actually, they had guns. Fuck that. Fuck uh, those walkie-talkies. <laughs> well, it's also... This is 2000, so not until, what, 9-11 did they change it? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Back then, we thought that my green thumb and my brother's vivid image... My green thumb. From the makers of my left foot. From the makers of my cousin Vinny. Yeah, <laughs> uh, you know, uh, my favorite Joe Pesci movie is the movie where he's a gardener, but he also uh, paints with his feet. Is that what my left foot is? He paints yeah. with his feet? Yeah, it was, it was a uh, true story. Guy who uh, painted with his feet. Well, it's kind of like how whenever they uh, train an elephant to paint with its trunk. Just like. <laughs> yeah, he, uh, he didn't say anything. <laughs> what? <laughs> what did I miss? <laughs> I just like how that, like, it, like, could be seen as you totally shitting on his accomplishments. <laughs> like, like this man, this brave guy, he was so expressive, he wanted to express himself through his art so bad that he went through the trouble of reteaching himself 
because he was so used to painting with his, with his hands to rewire his brain to now paint with his foot. Wow. You know, I heard a story about a uh, elephant that could uh, <laughs> paint with his trunk. Same thing. <laughs> Same you think you're so story. fucking big and bad. Nothing that elephant new. couldn't paint with anything in the first place. <laughs> exactly. He's all feet. He couldn't paint with any of them. Yeah, there's already there's already plenty of human painters. It's not an <laughs> elephant painter. He's the first one. <laughs> to my knowledge. Well, I'm the first guy that does it with his feet, so what? <laughs> He's the first painting pachyderm. No. <laughs> I mean, that's probably what that guy got paralyzed or whatever was so that he could just paint with his feet. <laughs> That's like, probably why he did it. Yeah, he just, did it for he attention. Just yeah, it's, like, it's like when Picasso cut off his ear. <laughs> he couldn't paint anymore because he usually painted with his ear. <laughs> exactly. Oh my god. Sex. Once again, sex. Oh, seeds. Yeah. Seeds. I'm gonna cover it in my seeds. I'm gonna cover it! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna cover it! <laughs> Jack in the bu- no, this came. Uh, it's Burger King. Look at it. It, it. it can't all even fit in frame. It's so goddamn big. He's got it. What was the origin of that little girl being in Pepsi commercials? I can't remember now. Because she was in Pepsi commercials. Uh, yeah, I think. It's I just, think it was just like, what was her what was her origin story? Because like, they, I don't yeah. think she had one. I th- wait, no, 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 no. She fell into some nuclear waste. <laughs> I think it was <laughs> Pepsi. She fell into some fucking Pepsi. Yeah, it was like the fucking scene in Batman. She was just hanging on a thing, and Batman just let her fall into a giant vat. Or like in Catwoman, where she uh, got pushed into the fucking garbage. Fucking and then water. a bunch of cans was... of Pepsi rolled up to her and rolled all over. <laughs> and she, like, she started twitching. She came home, started oh pouring Pepsi in all, the, in all the food dishes. Oh my god! I uh, see. I thought that she uh, had repaired her girlfriend's watch and left it in a giant can of Pepsi and went back in to get it, and it closed behind her, and then <laughs> ripped her uh, ripped her down to like a molecular level. Oh, mm. that's Watchmen. What are you doing tonight? There's a place. Wait, is this like a sex phone sex line? Is this this a sex? No, it's just for nightlife. It's for old people. Where quiet conversation. I love the nightlife. I love the dog race. Yeah, let's go watch some dog racing. Look at those tiny horses. (laughs) When did they outlaw dog racing? Um, I don't know if they have. I don't know. Yeah, I was going to say. I, I think they, they have. Park, only 25 minutes from Boston. In- 25 minutes from racist ass Boston, where they're probably the last people to fucking outlaw that shit. Horse racing should be illegal, honestly. Any animal racing should be illegal. Fucking bullfights. Stop fucking with animals! Ready to go? Ready! You're ready to go? Oh, what the <laughs> hell are they rolling? Oh, they're, everyone's allergic to grass. This is asking for trouble. Any way you can. For a McDonald's. Oh, they're uh, making him fuck. Uh, Did you see that? They were making him fuck. Click, click. Again, again. Each with a detachable clip. I have a clip a that I can clip. clip it to things now. Look at that. Did you see uh, fucking Ronald's stop. face on the cup? He's like, ah! <laughs> oh, now they're... Oh, creepy. Stop! <laughs> That's the last thing I, I ever wish, wanted to see Ronald McDonald do. I wish there were outtakes of uh, of that dude like knocking the shit out of that woman, like, <gasps> like fucking tailgate party chest bump. Yeah, cause the first time must have been terrible. Oh, the ecstasy yes, of what it does yes, to their hair. Yes. Is her hair a different color? Oh. Did you? Yeah. Men like it too. Yeah. <laughs> Told you. He just goes. Forever clear. Just your. Oh, who's this? It's fucking Everclear. Everclear, yeah. Oh, shit. I loved Everclear. Fucking father of mine. And uh, yes. I will buy you a. I will buy, buy you and, uh, a father of mine. <laughs> I'll buy you a father. Swim out past the breakers. Yeah. Watch, watch the father, the father die. die. <laughs> I swear, like they're. I like them fine, but every oh. song sounds exactly yeah, the same. Yeah, they're very, very similar. They're like you could just swap the lyrics to all of them, and it fits just fine. What is this for? Drug abuse? Yeah, yeah. daddy oh. gave me some drugs. Yeah, because the fucking lead singer was hard on drugs. Yeah, yeah. He went mm. hard in the drug paint. <laughs> <laughs> what about old LL? Did he love drugs? Did the ladies LL. love drugs? Oh man, I was. I hope he. I hope he does I'm Gonna Knock You Out at MTV Unplugged with big chunks of deodorant in his armpit hair again. <laughs> Look at that sleeve, the sleeve action going on, too. Yeah, this is like That's he's a cool. greaser. He's fucking got That's a smoke cool, yeah. rolled up in there. Let's just, wait, what? <laughs> Ella Cool J for fucking truth. Jeans. Oh, Whoa! shit. Oh. What the hell's this? Did he just strike that woman? What is 
this? Uh, never been kissed. Jesus <laughs> Christ, again, another star-studded, but don't fucking remember what the hell this is. Yeah, it's a fucking rom-com with- When the fuck did Ben Affleck and Sarah Bullock do a Sarah fucking- Bullock? Sarah Bullock? Sandra Bullock. Oh, Sarah Bollocks. Ooh, I do wow. not remember oh, yeah, that I one. I don't know that, that one. even existed. And Steve Zahn. Oh, and Blight Dan Danner, yeah. yeah. Pokemon by yourself? So close. Is that motherfucking- Oh my god, it is. It's, was it, it Drake and or Josh? <laughs> it's Josh. Have you seen the, the, the Have you seen uh, his dick on the internet? The name of the like antagonist of the movie. It's like, oh no, here comes Big Gum. <laughs> He's a Dick Tracy <laughs> villain that they kind of cast aside. <laughs> Al Pacino played him in the movie. Oh, okay. He loved Madonna's song she sang to him. And he threw his big fucking cum cells at her like like <laughs> tomatoes. <in> vaudeville. 